to. Back to. I'm from the hood, nigga. I will bag you. Yeah. Back three, back three, back four. Yes, man, it really is me. Me, Zool, aka the instant burner, man. And yes, double rep is upon us, y'all. Yes, we're gonna be having double rep this Easter weekend. And please, somebody tell me why is 2K giving us double rep on fucking holidays, my nigga? I'm not trying to be in the house playing this trash ass game when I could be spending time with my family, my nigga. But you already know it's 2K logic. If it made sense, it wouldn't be 2K logic. But I know a lot of y'all are gonna be playing some walk on, bro. Trying to get this rep. And if you're one of those people, bro, that doesn't play walk on, if you want to that plays twos or threes during, during double rep, my nigga. Why? Why are you wasting your time? Stop wasting your damn time and get in the walk-on, bro. Get in the walk-on pro-am, my nigga, because you're going to get way more rep doing that than playing those twos. Even though those twos are faster, you're not going to get nearly as much rep, bro. La Man, bro, last double rep, my nigga, no lie. Ask anybody I run with. I got over 40% on the SS1 bar, and I ain't even grind like that. You know what I'm saying? Playing just straight walk-on. You want to know... Your, your, your favorite YouTubers, how they grind and shit, bruh. They play walk-on during double reps, my nigga. That's how they get that's how they get them big-ass boots. So if you're not one of those people, you need to do that. But if you are one of those people that does play walk-on, you're going to be experiencing this a lot, bro. A lot of niggas quitting. If you blowing niggas out, a lot of niggas going to start quitting. And if you're on that team that's getting blew out, let me tell y'all something. A, a friendly tip. Do not be out here quitting Pro-Am games, my nigga. You lose rep. You literally lose rep, bruh. So don't be quitting any program games. If anything, bro, get get your A plus. Lose the game, get blew out, get your A plus. And I know some of y'all like, man, all you gotta do is close the app, or all you gotta do is is test your connection, and the game won't count. That's a fucking lie. That is a lie, bro. I've did it. I've tried it multiple times. It it does not work anymore, bro. And, and how they do it now? Like if you quit the game. Once you quit that game or whatever, it doesn't show on your record until the next time you play another game. So after you play another game, you, you done lost your rep, all that shit, bruh. It doesn't count. But if you're on the other end, bruh, and niggas is quitting on you, you blowing niggas out, I'm going to show y'all how to, how to fucking... It's, it's a glitch, bruh. It's a glitch on how to score every time because y'all already know how, how the fucking computer be cheating, bruh. Bruh, sometimes the computer don't even be looking at you, bruh. He don't look at you. He don't know the pass coming. But you you press that X button, he turn around, intercept the ball, bruh. Not even looking at you. Fake shit. But I got this glitch for y'all, bruh. I'm going to give y'all another tip. Let me give y'all a tip. Before I even talk about the, the glitch, my bad. Before I talk about the glitch, I'm going to give y'all a tip, bruh. When it comes to the computer on Pro-Am, they always play help defense next pass over. First pass over. If you don't know what that means, let's say let's say I'm, dri I'm driving to the lane with my dude. The, clo the closest player, the closest player is always going to help if he's the computer. And that, and that other cat is going to be wide open for the three or whatever. That's just a friendly reminder just in case you don't know. As you see on the screen, bro, we started the game fucked up. Look at this, bro. They only had two players on their team, bro. Trash 2K. Hey, it wouldn't be 2K if it wasn't trash. But we were struggling a little bit trying to figure out how to score. And then the second quarter, bro. We f I figured this shit out in the second quarter, bro. I know some of y'all gonna be like, man, I already knew about this shit, bro. This shit is old. This whole game is old. So if this whole game is old, of course this shit is old. Nothing in this game is new, my nigga. Think about it. But, yes, man. All you gotta do, bro, to do this glitch, all you gotta do is circle behind the player with the ball. If your dude is the is the computer, just circle behind the, the dude with the ball. And you're gonna and you're gonna eventually get open. Sometimes it takes one time, sometimes it takes three, four. You will eventually be open though, brother. The, the computer will eventually get caught up, my nigga. Just like you're seeing on the screen, bro. It's that fucking simple, bro. It's that simple, man. But if, if this video ended up helping you out, you already know what to do. And make sure to smash that like button if you're new. Please don't forget to subscribe, man. Because ain't no other YouTubers out here helping y'all like Mr. Mizzle. And y'all already know who this is. It is your boy, Mizzle.